Interoperability is very important to us at Michigan. Uh, we've been involved in open source and standards efforts for many, many years. Uh, certainly, uh, the Sakai community being one of the, the prominent examples of that as a founding institution. Uh, LTI, of course, uh, we've had some key contributors, Dr. Chuck Severance, uh, for example, on LTI. Uh, it's critical to our long-term strategy in terms of uh, controlling the teaching and learning ecosystem and what we're, what we're trying to do there making sure that uh, we have the ability to make choices about when and how we want to migrate and which tools we use and so forth. So it is quite critical to our, uh, not just our technology strategy, but also to our academic strategy. Mm -hmm. So IMS helps us achieve those goals with respect to interoperability in that it uh, brings together a community uh, of like-minded uh, individuals, institutions, vendors, and so forth with whom we can collaborate, build relationships, and uh, bring some of those things to fruition that, that we envision. Uh, Learning Impact is an important conference for, for me to uh, attend and participate in. I think primarily because of the individuals who attend and the relationships that, that uh, you can build here. Uh, a lot of this work is based upon uh, trust and relationships and the ability to meet with people and to uh, reinforce those ties is always important. Uh, this year, in fact, I've brought a couple members of my team along with me so that they can begin to get more enmeshed in the broader community um, and begin to build those relationships themselves and to build their own networks and to uh, all of which supports our overall agenda of interoperability and, and our strategy. One of the things that I think is important uh, for people to understand about Learning Impact is that there's actually a fair amount of work that actually gets done at the conference. Um, and there's lots of information sharing and, and learning that goes on too, uh, but there are people who are uh, actually hammering out details of specifications, writing code, obviously building relationships and, and coming to agreements as I mentioned earlier, uh, but it's, it's an active working event. And, uh, coming out of that uh, is always a good feeling that uh, you've actually achieved something in addition to, to learning some things too.